We're going to be talking about cough. Cough is one of the most common problems that a primary care physician sees in his office. But we're going to talk about a special type of cough today. Normally, several causes, but we're going to be talking about cold, dry air. The lungs like warm, moist air. So when the air gets cold and the air gets dry and we breathe that in, then the lungs become inflamed, actually. And so there's inflammation on the inside lining of the lungs just because of the cold, dry air. So we have to be careful if we've got a little bit of a cough. If we go outside in cold air and we exercise or we go skating or we do something where we're breathing in cold air, it will make that worse. The inflammation will cause swelling and the only way the brain knows to take care of that swelling is <coughs> a dry, relentless cough. And it's a very, very sensitive cough. People with asthma, one of the triggers they have of their asthma is cold, dry air. If we take an Olympic athlete and we put him up on a high uh, elevation in cold air where they're practicing for skiing, breathing in cold air with exercise actually causes inflammation and they begin to have wheezing and cough. So what can we do about that? Well, since we don't want cold, dry air, number one, we need to drink a lot of fluids. We need to do our exercising inside if we can. If the temperature is below 50 degrees, you need to be thinking about cold air can bother you. If you put a scarf over your nose and your mouth, you'll be re-breathing warm, moist air. And so those are some tricks of the trade that you can do. If you've got asthma, be sure and take your medicines. The medicines will help keep your lungs open and will help work against inflammation. So know that there are things that you can do for this, but be careful with that cold air. Now a question from the viewer, Dr. Bob. Can swollen feet be a sign of heart failure? Well, yes, it can. And there's many causes of swollen feet. But sometimes people that have low-grade heart failure, the heart doesn't pump the blood around good enough. And so with increased fluid that builds up in the heart, it settles in the feet and we get swollen feet. When your feet are swollen, there may be five pounds of water uh, that really need to be diuresed with medications. So if you have swollen feet that persist, then you need to be sure and talk to your doctor Cut down on your salt intake. Be careful of your heart. Take your medicines. If you're having chest pain, specifically see your doctor. And know that those swollen feet can go away with proper attention. They just don't go away by wishing them away. So today, we want to be sure that we don't exercise in cold air. And if you've got swollen feet, talk to your doctor about those.